My name is Dr. Noha Polak. I'm a pediatrician and I've been practicing pediatrics since 1996 in Northern New Jersey. And today my guest is Dr. Cheryl Kamek, who will introduce herself because she has way too many credentials for me to remember. <laughs> Hi everyone. My name is Cheryl Kamek, uh, also known as Cheryl Ross Kamek. I'm a pediatric cardiologist. I've been practicing for over 10 years. Um, my credentials are spanning a few states, including my uh, fellowship, uh, residency, and medical school. Um, medical school was in Pennsylvania, residency in New York, and fellowship in uh, California. Now I'm back home, back in New Jersey, Pennsylvania area. Um, I'm board certified in both pediatrics and pediatric cardiology. Um, I'm lucky to be working in this beautiful place um, with Dr. Nuha Polak and on Kennedy Boulevard. Um, it's been great. Awesome. Thank you so much for doing this video with me today. We get a lot of questions from parents about murmurs. So sometimes we hear murmurs in babies or even in older children. Dr. Kemi, can you tell us what is a murmur and whether we should be concerned about it or not? Well, a murmur is really just a sound. It's the sound of blood as it goes through your heart. Uh, sometimes it's from a heart defect or birth defect, but most of the time it's not, it's just a sound. We have to, based on the sound of it, based on the quality of it, sometimes it, it means we have to do additional testing to rule out birth defects related to the heart. But even after those tests, very small percentage of them uh, a less than 1% in most people will be up from a birth defect of the heart. Awesome. Thank you. And what kind of testing do you do to figure this out, Dr. Kamek? Um, we usually start out with an EKG that looks at the electrical activity of the heart. It sometimes gives us clues if there is a potential birth defect related. It also looks for heart rhythm problems that looks at the electrical activity. Some birth defects of the heart are associated with heart rhythm problems, so that gives us another clue. Um, then we do an ultrasound of the heart. An ultrasound is just taking pictures of the heart in different angles, just like what mom had when she was pregnant with the baby. It's not radiation or anything, but it gives us a very good picture of your heart. We can tell from those, typically, if there's a, a defect that's causing the murmur. Awesome. So thank you for the reassuring words. I totally agree with your point of view that a murmur is a sound. We often send our patients with murmurs to pediatric cardiologists to figure out what's going on. And the great majority of time, it's something very benign and reassuring. So thank you for speaking with me about that. So everybody, Dr. Kamik is in our office in Union City, and she is there every week on Tuesdays. If you need to be in contact with her, we're going to have a link for you in the show notes including her phone number. Have a great day. Thank you. Bye-bye.